This okay. is a sleepy mouse. And she's done. A tiny jumping meadow mouse having an itty bitty radio collar placed around her neck. She's not your typical zoo animal, but researchers at Chicago's Lincoln Park Zoo aren't planning to keep these collared mice here long. This will enable us to follow the mice as soon as we release them into the habitat. That habitat is here, a grassy Midwestern prairie. The site that we're on right now um, used to be farmland, um, and so we did a massive restoration project. Here, the mice are far from pests. Rearing to go here. They're an important part of this delicate prairie ecosystem. The mice will mate and help distribute the seeds they eat from these grasslands. A few mice and collars may end up in the stomachs of owls, coyotes, and other predators. This little guy finds it all pretty daunting. He may sit here a while, just kind of taking it all in. But with gentle encouragement, he hops out. Then, true to his name, he jumps and quickly disappears. Other mice get to stay in hideouts for a couple days to get used to things. Once released, the scientist will track them to see how they do. We can look at their movement from these spots and see where they go. If they just stay, you know, in a couple of meters of here, or if they start bounding a couple hundred meters, hopefully they stay close by. <laughs> but as the sunlight fades, that's a wrap on this episode of Little Mice on the Prairie. Martha Irvin, Associated Press, Grays Lake, Illinois.